Welcome to the meter stick and metric ruler, what we're using to measure distance. If you look at the meter stick above, you'll see that it has up to 90, which would go to complete 100, and that would be centimeters to complete 1 meter. So 1 meter is equal to 100 centimeters, and is also equal to 1,000 millimeters. Now we've moved into our general room. It's a blue room, we've got a red door, a gold handle. If we want to move our meter stick over toward the handle, starting at the floor to the height of the handle, we can recognize that it is one meter. This is, makes it a really good reference point if we're forgetting how far or how long is a meter. Remember, keep in mind that is also the same as a hundred centimeters. If we placed another meter stick on top, we can try to figure out how high the door is. In this case, it is just short of 2 meters. We'd have to rewrite that. You can't say it's 2 meters high, that would be inaccurate. So maybe it's 1.8 meters. So that means it's almost 2 meters, but it's not quite. Another way we can write that is 180 centimeters. Again, don't forget there's 100 centimeters in each meter. And in this case, we're short of 2 meters, so it's 180 centimeters. We move that decimal point two places to the right. Now let's zoom in on our meter stick. The smaller lines represent centimeters. So there you see 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 centimeters. Okay, and keep in mind also a finger is about the width of a centimeter. So that's a good reference point as well. Now there are smaller lines also on this meter stick. It'd be really silly if we decided to label every single one. Just think, 1 centimeter is equal to 1 millimeter. So we'd have to write 10 numbers between that 0 to 1 centimeter. Now say we want to measure something like an Expo marker. We line it up from 0 to as far as it extends. I'm going to draw a line here so you can see where the end of the red cap meets on the meter stick. It's going to be definitely past the 10 centimeter mark. And we can see the larger lines representing centimeters 11, 12, we get to looks like 13 centimeters. So we're going to write 13 centimeters. That's also the same as saying it is 0.13 meters. Or we could even say it's 130 millimeters if we want to go to that sort of unit. More common than a meter stick, we often use a ruler. But carefully look at the numbers. Most have a side in inches, like 12 inches, a typical American foot. And the other side has centimeters. Now an average 12 inch ruler has about 30.4 centimeters. Here's your turn to practice. See if you can guess the measurements for these four arrows. Continue watching and the answers will pop up. The red arrow is 4.4 centimeters, or 44 millimeters. The orange arrow is 2.4 centimeters, or 24 millimeters. The green arrow is 3.4 centimeters, or 34 millimeters. And lastly, the blue arrow is 3.1 centimeters, or 31 millimeters.